Captain. I know what you got over there. Yeah. And then you got, I know I touch it. You're a big, you, I am a Masonic, and you're done from the Rosa Cruz. Yeah, that's, yeah, that's, yeah, that's. Hey, welcome to Belize. We are in Corzo town in northern Belize. I did a live video yesterday. Sadly, the internet that you get through your phone here, I got from Smart, it sucks. Sorry, Smart. But I gotta tell you the truth, your internet sucks for live streams. It's okay if you, if you shoot a, something and you upload it. Yeah, that works great, but live streams, no good. So I was gonna do live stream every day but because of that, I'm not gonna do it. Because just, I looked at the video last night. Horrible quality. Eventually I'm gonna take it down and just replace it with a recorded one. But it was good because we walked around, we talked to a lot of people. We saved an iguana's life, all kinds of stuff. But hey, that's how it goes. They're not ready yet. Hi, good morning. They're not ready yet for live video with the phone services we have here in Belize. So let's see what we can find for you guys today out here in the market. We are melting. It actually is a little cooler today because it rained. Yeah, but humidity is really bad. Yeah, humidity is really bad. Look at, look at the sticker this pickup. <laughs> <laughs> look at that. We also came to Belize from Mexico for the 10th of September celebrations. Looks like we Which is tomorrow. Time. I don't think it's gonna happen because Queen Elizabeth II died. Yesterday. And since we're British Commonwealth. Hey, Mr. Wolf, what's up, man? What's up, man? And that will put the- You're a friend, man. Hey, long time I see you, remember I guess. Me? Yeah, yeah. You and me. Mm-hmm. Yeah, man, I see you put orders. Exactly, yeah, yeah. I never forget that big order. All right. So that kind of put, What's up, dude? You the make noise again about town? Uh, you the make noise again about town? That's what we did. Uh, we are from right. way back. So yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, that's that good. Oh, I'll see you wrong later. Wrong, wrong, wrong later because we left soon, soon. All right. Going back to Mexico soon. All right. I come for the tent. Yeah, I'll take care, my buddy. Okay, then. That's how it goes here. You just stop in traffic and talk to somebody. Yeah, so since the Queen died, yeah. I think the parades, I think everything will be called off. So We're not sure yet. We're not sure, we're not sure. Yeah. We're going to find out tomorrow what happens. Because people are saying, to hell with the Queen, keep doing it. Others are saying, no, respect the Queen. So yeah. we don't know. So we're going to see if we find our favorite cochinita taco guy. We always get tacos here, Noemi's tacos. But on Fridays and Saturdays, we get tacos here from our favorite place. Let's see if they have. Hola, hola. Hi, guys. Hi. Hola, como están? Feliz my wireless. Charro negro. Uh huh. You work here. Eh, no llegamos. Um, El, de, de digamos, el, ¿qué día? What day, what day did we get here? I don't even remember, man. Hace dos días. ¿Cuánto está? Cinco dólares. Cinco dólares. So this is our favorite taco man here. He makes the good stuff. Hola, buenos días. Tú haces los buenos tacos aquí. Eso está diciendo la gente. Con chile. Con chile. I do have another video with him that I did a long, long time ago. So make sure you check it out. His tacos are good, right? Really, really good. Yes, for sure. Yes. And all handmade. Let me show you. Hey, that's how he does it. Puts see a little onion. And uh, that red thing back there, that's pepper. I puts a little pepper onto it. And boom, it is done. So while he makes my tacos, I'm gonna get myself my favorite Coca-Cola. How many do you want? How many do you want so I can tell the lady? 
There you go. You're so handsome. He reminds me of my little brothers. When Hello. Say hi to the camera. Say hi. Say hi. You're gonna be on YouTube. They, 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 they will see you the states and the Canada and the China about. Yeah, your granny will see you. Yeah, your granny that state they are said. It, your, your daddy, your, your daddy when see you way to California. Say hi, daddy. We just came back from. Say hi, daddy. Hi, daddy. All right. Um, I want, um, I don't know, I think Five dollars? Five dollars with yeah. pepper? With pepper, yeah. All right. Let me... With, with, you sure with pepper? His oh, pepper's hot. Not so hot. Not so hot today? Not too hot. Today. Not too hot. Mi esposa va a querer cinco dólares con chile también. Okay. Cuando termine. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Let me go get a cook. Get me a small water. Small water, okay. Ice cold. Ice cold? All right. Wait from the window. Yeah. Hello. I need one. Uh, one coke, big coke, and um, one water. One of the ice cooled ones, small water. Three bottles in there. When you're done. There's the water. The coke I'm a little part this up high. That's going to open up the coke for me. Here's the store inside, check it out. Saludos, a la cabra. That's in YouTube. <laughs> Here's a little store. I can't see much because they got this plastic here. I can't see much, but you guys were inside. And this is our typical routine here on Friday mornings in Belize. We go and we get our tacos. Wow, you have a big name. You, 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 you talk to your daddy? You get a pen and, and write down so that when you talk, you could give him, give him the... I don't have a pen. I, I'm not your secretary. I'm sorry. I, 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 I don't know where to get a pen here. Some of you have a pen. I don't that way you know. could give him the link and then he could see it. Oh, to see son. Okay. Nobody has a pen here. Yes, please. Okay, let's in here. May I press it to lapis Where there's a will, there's a way. Well, that's why you do it yourself. Come on. Quinto. Quinto, Quinto, Quinto. 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 Uh, yeah. 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 Ahorita te lo doy. Ya vamos. That's why you tell them make you look for dog pee vlogs on YouTube and you'll see you soon. Tomorrow you're gonna come out the video. Oh, yeah. Say bye daddy. Say bye. I hope you enjoy seeing me on the bye, video. Daddy. Tell daddy His bye. name is Clinton. Douglas. That's Clinton. Yeah. So Clinton sending wait highs to his daddy in California. <laughs> Alright, bye Clinton. <laughs> bye bye. So happy. Gracias. Ah, right, so. He reminds me of Chato. Yeah, I know. I know. <laughs> so we're going to eat some tacos here at the market while they're rolling them up. Let me walk you through the taco market area. I came through here yesterday. 
But as I said, video is really bad transmission. Hello, good morning. It was very bad transmission. So I'll just do a recording. Show you guys a recording instead. I won't go too far because I want to go eat. Hi. I gotta go eat. I don't want my tacos to get old. But this is the market, guys. I do have some other market videos. Today's just gonna be a random little bit of everything. Gotta make it. Oh, cool shades. Cool shades. So a little random bit of everything. I'm gonna have it for you all to see. Your tacos are here, man. My tacos, great. So my tacos are here. This is five dollars Belize, two dollars US, and got this myself is $7, a coke. Seven dollars, seven fifty or seven dollars. She says each taco is seventy-five cents now. Oh, they went up in price. Yes. Wow. Of course, everything is higher. Yeah, yeah, that's true. So that's seven or seven fifty, something like that. Oh yeah, oh yeah. There, yeah, one seventy-five cents yeah. one now. Yeah. Wow. Inflation. It's, that's everywhere. Blame it on. Who knows who? Hey, <laughs> I, won't, hey, I won't say no hey. names. Anyway, I'm I gonna, gonna go, I was gonna say beep. Yep. So I gotta take one bite, see if it's good, and then I'm gonna shut the camera off. Okay, have you seen me eat tacos here before? Look for the video. So yeah, see por favor. See guys, see why I don't do things for him now? Because look, he did not order mine. I had to go order my one because the lady says he only ordered one plate. No, I told her. No, she said no. She came to me and she says, Oh, you gonna eat? I said, Yeah. I just told her. I have done the video. I have done video where I ordered this. Okay, well, she I says have, she I have the proof that I ordered. Okay, but, guys, he got saved now. <laughs> but what, what it is, they're like really um, getting ancient and um, wow, they don't they don't amazing. remember <laughs> they don't remember that's why you give one order at a time so while they were they making mine yeah. while, I, while they were making mine I told her could you um, make five bucks five dollars tacos for my wife okay all right all right totally forgot one yeah. minute one second after I quit telling her <laughs> oh man see you in a bit after I eat he did not order. I said, really? I said, okay, that's okay. I want, <laughs> yeah. I want $5. She says, that's how she told me. Yeah. No 75 cents more. Yeah. I have so. proof right here on this video that I ordered. I ordered in Spanish, though. He got saved, guys. He got saved. <laughs> See you in a little bit. Let me eat. Bye. The tacos were great. I'm going to pay the cashier. Quince dollars. Gracias. Muy sabroso. Muy sabroso otra vez. ¿Cuándo se van otra vez? El once. Ah. Once. Mañana. O, once. Pasado mañana. Pasado mañana. Ah, yeah. Mañana. Yeah. Pero no van a no, hoy es no, no vamos a, a Tabasco. Pero fines de... He asked when we're leaving. I said on the 11th of September we're going back to Tabasco. Sí. Eh. Sí. Gracias. ¿Será que va a haber celebración? Yeah, I told him he has when we're going, going, I said, we're going back to Mexico on the 11th of September. We just did a few days here. Great, great, great meal. I think they have a sink around the corner here. I can oh look in the background there, Mennonites. I think they have a little sink I can bore here to wash my fingers. So these are Mennonites from the Mennonite village. They come to town here to sell their goods. Here people are buying food. Hi. Right. How are you guys doing? How is the food? Good food? All right. Taco time. Yeah. And patties. All right. The two good stuff. Yeah. 
You guys gonna be on YouTube tomorrow. Tomorrow? Tomorrow, yeah. You wanna send saludos to any family that states or Belize or? Yeah, family back home and abroad. Hello to everybody. All right, there you guys heard it. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Did I see you guys? All right. Here we have some Mennonites from Donny Vienna and Little Belize. Little Belize? Okay. Ah. ah, bueno verles aquí. ¿Qué andan viniendo? No, nada. No, nada, solo paseando. Quiero pasaporte. Oh, pasaporte. Muy bueno. ¿Vas de vacación? ¿Vas, vas en vacación? Oh, no. No, solo para ir a Chatamal y cosas así. Yeah, all right. ¿Cómo te llamas? Johan Thiessen. Johan Thiessen, guys. Ese es Johan Thiessen. Estoy haciendo un video para YouTube. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. ¿Y tú cómo te llamas? Peter Brown. Peter Brown. All right. Todos a Little Belize. Nosotros fuimos a Little Belize hace varios meses. Okay. Bye. So I told them that. Um, oh, there's Maria there. I told them that we were in their community and we went to visit a guy who lives there, Jacobo Hildebrand. Check him out, he's in one of my other videos. And they said they know him, so I said, when you see him, tell him I said hi. They speak only Spanish and low German. Yo, what you think? Hi, good. All right. Except, good. except like I may do it live. It may leave it snowy, like the picture no good, so I did do it again. Yeah, I So this it. is the famous, this is the famous dollar bag man. I watch it on a big television screen. All right. Yeah, great. Uh, okay, well, good, man. Yeah, I filmed them yesterday, <laughs> but uh, because it did it slow, the picture was a little snowy, so I'm doing it again today. Uh, I'll be on tomorrow. And you go back today? I go back, no, I go back into Mexico on the 11th. Mexico. Yeah, we live in Mexico for like you a year do now. Videos. Do more videos uh, over there, yeah. You're doing a good thing. Yeah, I know. I watch you at the marketplace back there. Uh -huh. I say, wow. We got a and lot of videos. Came out to us and very, very clean. Yeah, we got a lot of videos at Corzo. I saw you were eating the tamales right there. Uh huh. Yeah. yeah. Great, great. Uh, I, I'm glad you're watching it. I'm glad you're watching it. Yeah. I need a, need people to be watching the videos. To yeah. make a good living. So business, you got your... Morning, I don't got no dollar bag today. No dollar bag today. Yeah, nothing good back there. And it's yeah. very expensive and yeah. nobody to buy it back. So this guy, if you didn't see him in yesterday's video, that was kind of bad because it was a live stream. What he did, he invented the dollar bag. Dollar bag shopping here in Corsa. Explain to them the dollar bag so they can see it. <laughs> Explain how he worked. Huh? Explain how he worked the dollar bag. Oh, the dollar bag? Oh, I go, I go to the marketplace and I buy their, I buy their street peppers for, for a dollar a pound, and that's more or less like six medium-sized pepper, and I, I put two of them in a dollar bag. Yep. Ah, uh -huh. so I make double. Yep. Three yeah. times. Three times. Much. Three times as uh -huh. much. Yep. Uh huh. And, and that cilantro, I, I buy their cilantro, two dollars, three dollars a pound, and I make them in a little dollar bag. Like right here, cucumber is a dollar bag right there. Yeah. You know? Yeah. Everything I do dollar bag. Sweet peppers, cucumbers, uh, cilantro, limes, habanero peppers, anything. Anything. Dollar bag. And that's how you make your living. Two thirds of the people here are third class. Right. And they have lots of children. So they can't afford to buy a pound at the market for three, four dollars. They can buy a dollar bag. Right. You know? Uh, you had you had the genius idea, uh -huh. very genius idea. Everybody can afford to buy. Food. I know. Even the rich people buying dollar bags right now. Exactly. Yeah. Uh -huh. Yeah. You got to stretch that money, uh, man. At the market, the pound is very expensive. Yep. Very expensive. Yeah. Very very true. Uh -huh. Very very true. Yeah. So you came up with a <laughs> good idea. Dollar bag, veggie. Dollar bag, man. Dollar bag veggie man. It, it, it surprised me because. When I came here, nobody selling dollar bags. They're yeah. only selling stuff on the scale. Yeah, right. And they're, they're, they're in that business for years and years and years. Yep. You know? Very and good. And the first time I came, I didn't have the money. Uh -huh. and, and a Mennonite farmer, he said, hey, you want to sell? And he gave me a sack of sea pepper, and two buckets of tomato, and two bags of cilantro. Yeah. And I came right over here, and I started a dollar bag, and people started proud of me. 
12 o'clock, I went back and I paid the man. Wow. Half and a half. Great. Yeah. And right from there. Your business, uh, your business began. The market people started to watch me because it was right over here. Yeah. The market people noticed that all the people come to the dollar man. Yeah. And so they started to make dollar bags too. Uh -huh. And now even the Chinese merchants. Everybody doing dollar bag now. Stores. They have got about that's competition how it yeah. works yeah See, they realize that the majority of the people can afford a dollar <coughs> can afford a pound right yeah so you had a good good idea yeah. i know you're genius got, man you're the genius economy is really down and jobs very scarce you are a genius huh you're a genius ah. <laughs> i want to make 50 cents back now yeah <laughs> the newest newest invention the 50 cent bag man i want to make 50 cents back I shut down the market people with, with, with my dollar bag. Uh-huh. Yeah, yeah. Good idea. I, I always trouble. I always trouble with my bags. I have to pay six dollars for, for a pound of bags. I always trouble with my bags. Do anything, anything passing by. You got it. You're I ready. Stop them and I got my bags. I'm ready. I'm ready. Ready for business. Yeah. 24 hours I'm a ready. day. <laughs> Smart guy, smart guy. <laughs> ready. Well, it's good talking to you again. Are you going to be on the next video again no. too? Yeah, because you're always great. <laughs> you're always great to talk to. Hey, and I, and I can do dollar bucks any part of the world I go. Anywhere you go, That's I know. Yeah, exactly. That's morning right off, but right away. And you got no boss. You're the boss. <laughs> it might not be much. But you can make enough to survive. Exactly. If I, if I leave Florida Town and I go to Belize City, or I go to Kyle, or any other part of the country, I can do five dollars. Yeah, bag. yep. And you're in business. Start making some money right here, right in the street. Right on the spot. Yeah. Smart guy, yeah. smart guy. <laughs> Good thing. Right. I don't want to keep care. you back because you have other work you want to do, you yeah. know? Yeah. Yeah, I got to do the video over because yesterday's one, I, I, I put on my phone, because I did it with my phone, yeah. put in a smart internet chip. And the quality, you saw the quality is really bad. So I'm redoing it all over again. So I'm glad I met up with you again. So I can redo you over. And then the yeah. other one, I'm going to delete it off of, off of YouTube. And, yeah. and the people in the States will see that. Yeah, people in the yeah. States can see it. Yeah. yeah, States. People watch me in the States. They watch me in China and India and Canada, Mexico. All over the world, people watch you me. You see, when people complain and they say they can't find a job, they can't find a job. Yeah. There are lots of things to do to create your own job. Exactly. So I tell everybody, everybody was born, as they say, with five senses. Right. But I'm born with six. Uh-huh. The six, my sixth sense is creative imagination. Because that yeah. is what I use to create the Dalabak. Creative imagination. Yep. Very you know? good, very good. That's why I created my Dalabak. That's the uh -huh. way of life. And Dalabaks would never stop selling until the end of the world. Yeah, that's for sure. So I will always be able to buy my little food stuff. Yep. You survive. Aww. Yep, we survive. Aww. That's all you need. Very good. And, and when I go when, when I go buy these stuff from these people, they give me extra. Yeah. And that's a little extra profit Aww. right there. So the extra pays for my, my plastic bag. Uh-huh. <laughs> smart, smart guy. Very smart guy. Good meeting you. You want to keep your back. Have a nice day. Okay, bye. Yeah, yeah. yeah. What's, what's up, Munchie? Yeah. I got hey. the... Hey, how are you? Hey. Hi. I got the world-famous Ramon Escobar here, former oh, clerk of court. Look, I am talking here. Please. <laughs> This hey, come here, come here, come here. <laughs> this guy, this guy, this guy saved my life many times. I'd be in jail if it weren't for him. <laughs> Clerk of court, Ramon Escobar. <laughs> He's running. He's scared of the camera. Hey, dudes, we're back again. We're back again. The next video is kind of snowy, so I redo it now. All right, good, good, good. Here we are, Corozal Town Family Supermarket, Chinese owned and operated. The original owners were from were from New York, they're Chinese from New York and um, they're gone now, somebody else took it over. I turned this off because of the music. We are here, here's a Coca-Cola truck. 
and these guys drive around town drive around town and deliver coke and water and stuff to all the stores and villages right you guys deliver all over the place he's gonna put on his got put on his uniform so he don't get in trouble with the boss <laughs> he was wearing it don't worry he was wearing it and here this used to be a former gas station now they have little food stall there and there they repair shoes or something all right and here is my buddy here from bone and bone working all over the place yeah delivering cokes and, yeah you got stock up all the stores and everything good long time yeah right now we're we're living in mexico for a while now yeah we're living in mexico for making youtube videos yeah all right uh, here comes another hard worker what's up rick yeah all right still the jam with bowen and bowen that's good that's good busy weekend to come up right i hope we got parade and everything tomorrow we got parade tomorrow i hope you think so you don't think they're canceled because the queen i don't know i know not. i heard maybe because the queen died they might cancel but i hope not okay. i mean because this people wait for this all year i come away from mexico here to to film this so okay i i need a parade tomorrow okay, <laughs> okay dude good see you man you're gonna be you're gonna be on youtube tomorrow yeah and yeah, he works I mean, for this company B&B yeah, I mean, yeah. which is bone and bone largest largest company in Belize almost you right yeah. coca-cola Belican water coffee what else do they make everything and um, juice juices you name it they make it okay dude take care that's the bone and bone company started by Barry Bone a long time ago and then um, they make belican beer and cokes and all kinds of stuff so just doing a walkabout course out town yeah man how you do yeah uh -huh, yeah yeah <laughs> yeah long time ago really long time ago doing good doing good yeah you have to come back here from home because you, you I always got to come back of course he says no yeah old but not cold old but not cold that's true yeah i'm very old but i'm not cold <laughs> very true okay, okay Brian, good to see you. yeah good to see you my old man no he done that long time ago oh oh very good definitely not getting old and not getting not getting cold either she's not old and not cold guys <laughs> He's trying to, to fix okay. it up. Yeah. Yep. I saved myself. Are oh, you running taxi now? Yeah, all right. Okay. Never you know remember my friend Marcelo. Angel. You run all the way to Chet? Yeah, I got a chip. How much you charge for like one chip trip? I just ran to Lumla. How much you charge like one chip trip to to the airport? To the to Charama? Yeah. Hundred dollars, all right. Okay. So, you know, if you guys need a taxi, hundred bucks, Belize, fifty dollars US, he'll take yeah, you all the way to Chetabo in Mexico. I run to Lom, I can go to Oh yeah, all the way there also. I go to the airport, the international airport. To but uh, but as, 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 as Belizean, as Belizean to the airport, I know that that is illegal. No, you could drop somebody up, but you, you can't drop. pick nobody up. No, you you can pick up. Yeah. You can pick up. I pick up because it's my customer. Is like, Go and they come back. I I sound the news. No, yeah, that, that, that's not a problem. With yeah, somebody. yeah, yeah. They were they were. They were yeah, they, yeah. They, if you pick up them. customers, we need, to, we need to adjust this thing with the Ministry of Transport. Yeah, right. Because yeah. how they could come, you know, like exactly. The Mexican exactly. taxi is coming here. In yeah, the they are, They have it. If a Belizean taxi goes to yeah. the Mexican airport, uh, yeah. the, the Mexican yeah. taxi guys they, they want to attack. Yeah, they them. want to they attack want them. Want they them. They cannot do the job at yeah, all. So they can they can drop off. Yeah, because anyone can drop yeah, off. If you but if you pick up somebody, from, and you're not from the Mexican airport taxi association, you pick up somebody there, and you're not from there, big trouble. Big, big trouble. Okay, let's okay. keep on walking. All right, man. Take care. Good seeing you. Okay. Take care, right? Nice seeing you. Yeah. yeah, they are really funny about that. 
Yeah, because they don't want to lose the, 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 the jobs. Either. Right, yeah. Their money making. Yep, yep. That's and they paid, they paid for all of that. Hey, look at your watermelon. Look at the watermelon, that looks good. Nice watermelon. Sweet, 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 right? What do you think if we cook some beans? You want some beans? I just ate tacos. No, I don't. No, no, I know, but you don't want to cook? I don't even like talking about food after oh. eight. <laughs> I just had ten tacos. Oh, and I ate like four or six a year or so. When I see fresh beans like that, I want to cook beans, guys. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, a lot of people out here selling. Oh, look at the golden plum. Yeah. These here are no golden plum. No, no, I no, I, I, I golden plum. Maduros. They're this really is good. A, this, this, this golden plums, guys. They're very, very nice. Um, it's sour, a little sour. You peel them, and uh, and they're nice. But inside, it's a trick to eat them because inside, it has lots of. Uh, it's like a big thing like this, full of prickles. Yeah. Like, not prickles, but something hard. Yeah, the, the hard. seed, yeah, like yeah. like yeah. stems coming out of it. Yeah, yeah, like a lot. Yep. Yeah, a lot. So it's really hard to eat. So I love I love the 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 ripe ones are easier to eat. Yeah, the ripe ones the ripe ones are nice and yeah. soft. Yeah. Nice and soft and they're pretty sweet. They're kind of like a tart, kind of a tart taste. It's uh, when they're too young. Yeah. yeah. When, uh, when they're too young. Hola. Corzo Town, Belize. I check my battery. Still good. Hello. Douglas. Oh, hello. Yes, Douglas. <laughs> Everybody's out here selling, selling, hustling, making some money. Hey guys, how you guys doing? Good. Uh, whoa, I like your hair. Look at your hair, so long. <laughs> What's up, dude? You all right? Yeah. How's things going? Everything is good. Still do my house for food and do car wash. Ah, you do car wash too? And how's oh. things for food? Great. I just want to be on me tomorrow, man. I have to go on to the market with people who know me. I wash people. Okay. So I will show them my experience. All right, How sure. How much you charge so we can tell oh, them? $10. $10, dollars please. Yeah. So every... Ten dollars inside and outside. You gotta be there. You gotta be there tomorrow. All right. Maybe I stop by tomorrow and watch how you wash. Make a video of you washing the car. And yeah. All right. We're gonna check you out there tomorrow. Take care, man. Good luck. Yeah. Okay. Bye bye. So he washes cars and he said delivers food also. He wants me to go and have barbecue. Pork yeah, he said today he's delivering barbecue pork chops. And he wants me to go by the market tomorrow and film. Hello! <laughs> hey, how are you? <laughs> Doing good? <laughs> All right, YouTube. <laughs> he wants me to go by the market tomorrow and film him washing a car. So if I get out there in time. And if he has any customers. And if he has any customers, <laughs> I will go and do that. Yeah. I think I think they want to be they want to they want to they want to be on YouTube. Let me go say hi to them. I don't know who they are. Hey, how are you guys? Fine, sir. Everybody fine? Yes, sir. Good yeah. seeing you. Yeah. <laughs> so, give your name to the camera so people can see. Maurice Rodriguez and Delfina Velasquez. Uh -huh. your wife? Uh, you are going to be my Kamala wife. Yeah. All right, cool. Congratulations. You guys going to be on YouTube. It's going to be on tomorrow this video. I'm going to prepare it tonight. Hopefully for tomorrow morning it'll be out. Yeah. So, why are they walking around? Yeah, we just we are salesmen having a little business selling couple of things you know oh yeah biscuits stuff like that uh-huh my partner of us great uh, great best salesman we got biscuits we got all kind of things all kind of stuff you sell that independence for yeah. the tweet yeah and i'm sending him request for independence day for my country beliefs to everyone all right Happy independence day part of us on my yep fiance right here so Great. Yes, everyone from Orange Rock. Oh, you guys originally yeah, from Orange Rock? Orange Rock. All right. right. So we're here. I, I made a video from Orange Rock. Yeah, 
Yeah. At the market, you have to look for oh, it on my channel. <laughs> yeah, yeah, at the Orange Rock at the market, look for it on my channel. I walk about the market and talk to the people. You, you got the name of my channel, right? Yeah. yeah. Okay, so All right, good meeting you. Bye. There you had it. They were happy to see me. They recognize a lot of people around here. They know me. Hey, dude, what's up? You all right? Yeah, man. You work hard? Yeah, I'm trying to shine up, shine up the ride? Trying to make something. Exactly. Right here, nobody not giving nothing. Nobody give nothing. I know. Everybody got to work. Well, that's good. Working, working is the way to do it. I know, yeah, yeah. Exactly, that's the best way to do it. Yeah. Take you like a, a beggar or chief or something like that, yeah. And if you go do work, honest way to make a living, yep. I have a nice trimmer, I, I, I go and I chop yard out too. Oh really? You chop yards and all that? Right now I do not have any yard to chop. I know. This week is very tough for me, man. Yeah. Uh, with this with girlfriend's sick. Oh I boy. Come out here and grind every day. Yeah. Rough, and then with this rain, one one people would like their vehicle to wash. I know, yeah, because they wait till the rain done. And then it gets muddy back. Yeah, right? yeah. Except the good thing with the rain, the yard, the grass gonna grow, and you got yards to chop again. Ah, yeah, but then while it's raining, they don't give you jobs. They don't want to give you jobs, you have to yeah. Wait till when the sun came out, then you can. Right. Very, what, very what, true. What can you do for me, good? Well, people see that you're a hard worker here on YouTube, and they'll give you a call, and they're gonna give you jobs. Hopefully, hopefully, you know. Look at the car, look at the car, how nice and shiny. He does a good job. How your name? James. James. This is James. James Luck. Give James James Luck. Give James a job. He can do your yard. He'll wash your car. Paint your house. Paint your house. Anything. He's ready to work right now. Give him a call or look for him. Where they can find you? You can call me on six zero six zero zero nine zero. There you hit. Say one more time. Six zero six zero zero nine zero. That's my number. Give James a call. He's right here. Give him a call. Give him a job. He's ready to work. He'll give you a good deal too. All right, James, take care. Here we go. Where are you, Maria? I lost her. She's somewhere. This here is the town hall of Corazon. Let me walk in and show you the awesome mural. The cool mural. What's, hey, what's, up, what's up, dude? How are you? I'm good. Doing good? Yeah. Here, hold me camera while I rub, rub my gel on my hand. Sure. Kill off these Wait, germs. I see, I see with Maria, she's doing the same thing. Yeah, yeah, she's doing the same thing. Yeah, that's what we do. We do YouTube videos. Okay. Traveling all over. We live in Mexican side for like about a year now. Oh, that's cool. We came for the tent, so I hope we still got the tent. Ah, yes. Because with the queen dying, right, right. we don't know what's going on. So hopefully, I gotta show the mural to the people. Yeah. So this is Corzal Town. Corzal Town's famous mural was painted by Manuel Villamor, Mexican artist, many, many years ago. There was other, actually another mural underneath this one. And he says, oh, I wasn't a good painter that time. I'd like to redo it. So, he painted a new mural, new mural on top of this one. Really cool. And here we have a painting of the first Prime Minister of Belize, Right Honorable George Cadle Price. Oh, this is here, is a picture of the original mural that was on this wall. That's a drawing of it. And this here is the town office. This here is the Belize flag. And this is Baron Bliss. He is a big benefactor here in Corazon Town. And when you get your driver's license, you come here to this office here. Hello. Let's see if I can see you through the glass. Oh yeah, I can see you. <laughs> And they have the transport. I uh, take while you walk in, yeah, right? 
This is the Corzo Transport Office. Guys working hard? A little bit. <laughs> Hello. You want to say hi to the camera? No. You're shy? Ay, ay, ay. She's shy. So everybody's here at work at the revenue unit. And this is customer service. Everybody's kind of hanging their head. They're all hardworking people. Everybody working hard. How you doing? All right? Yes, sir. All right. The mayor's office is somewhere behind there. But he's a busy guy, so I'm not going to bother him. You guys want to say hi? Now I got you good on camera. <laughs> all right. They are working hard, making sure all the money is going in the right place, too. Or? Yes, sir. All right. And collecting your taxes and driver license fees, everything, too. Yes, sir. All right. You guys going to be on YouTube tomorrow. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Sometime tomorrow. I'll, I'll prepare the video tonight for upload it for tomorrow. Sometime by midday and be out. Okay. That's really nice. All right. And this here is... Oh, here's the old town clock, the way it used to look. And whoa, this yes, hello. the world famous Alex Ewing. He's on the phone. Okay. He's a busy man. How are you doing, Alex? You all right? Good to see you. So here we are. This is the Corzo town office. Everybody's working hard. So let me get out of there. Because everybody kind of freezes up when they see the camera. But they're doing a good job. They're doing a really good job. Town is looking pretty good. And we are back outside. Behind that glass window is the mayor's office. We know the mayor very good. But I don't want to bother him. He's a good guy. Good, good guy. He's also a five-time Belize bodybuilding champion. Five or six times, I don't remember. But we got muscles. Big, big muscles. Across the street here, the Catholic Church. Let me go into the Catholic Church and show you the crucifix that my sister carved many years ago. This is the parish office, the priest residence. Xavier College used to be at this location, right there. I went to school here for a little while, actually. I was in that building. This building right there, I went to school. You never know, I might even be in one of those pictures. I'm gonna see if I can sneak into the church from the back door. And then, whew, I'm out of breath, I was walking too fast. And I'm way too fat. I wanna see if I can sneak in and show you guys the crucifix. Oh, I know, it's the side door, it's not this one show you guys the crucifix that my sister carved by hand wow how long ago 40 years ago or so close to 40 years ago this is the school here st francis xavier school classes are going on i can hear the teachers talking here is the back of the church if you want to come in and pray this door is always open here is the school, classes are going on, and here we are inside the Catholic Church here in Corzo Town, Belize. Here is the crucifix that my sister carved. Let me go up and show you guys. This is it. This is it here, look at that. It's carved out of a solid piece of mahogany, except for the arms, because we couldn't get a log that wide. And the body and the cross, it's all in one. It's all together in one. I'm actually not supposed to be walking in front of this because that's the Eucharist. I hope I don't offend anybody. But I just want to show you guys the beauty of this thing here in Corzo Town. Let me extend my camera a bit. Look at, look at the details. Look at the details on the feet. Look at that. It's life size. And this is the rest of the church here. 
Big building. Big, big building. Do you know that to get the rib structure and everything for that crucifix, that my sister actually hung me up on the wall like this to see how the ribs look. I was skinny that time. If she'd hang me up now, I'd look like a pot bellied pig getting ready for slaughter. Virgin Guadalupe, Juan Diego, she always got candles. Some of the saints around, more in the back there. Yeah, so my sister, she hung me up. Let me fix my camera here. My sister, she hung me up on the back wall of my parents' house to see how the body looks when it's like hanging like this from across. And then she sketched it, sketched it all out. And then she got that chunk of wood and went to work. And it took her over a year or a year or almost over a year to carve that sculpt, that piece of masterpiece that you see here in the Catholic Church. And she donated it to the church, so it belongs to them. But it's been in this church ever since. Beautiful piece of art. So we are back outside. Back there is the House of Culture. You can see that in another video that I have. I wonder why they got the Mexican flag. Maybe because they, they have Mexican priests or something. Not 100% sure. Well, let me go walk around and see something else. I'm gonna turn this off here a bit because of the loud music. Here we are by the town, Central Park. This is Central Park here. They have people, they come here in the evenings. Oh, look, you can get smoothies. Frozen drinks. Frozen, Frozen drinks. Blue Hawaiian margarita. Cool. Hi. Right. Hello. Without liquor, right? Without liquor? With liquor? Really? You have, you have permit to, to sell liquor here? No. Really? How, how long you been doing this like that? Like two years. Two wow, years cool. Oh my God. You want one? Um, um, I want pina colada. Okay. He wants a pina colada and I want a... You have a salty dog, no? What you have in it is that's not too margarita, a margarita for me, please. Piña colada and a margarita for him. Cool, you could get smoothies here. I ordered myself a piña colada because I like sweet drinks. Who are you, Maria? She got herself a blue margarita. Look at that, and it matches her fingernail. Look at that. Oh, I felt a few drops of water coming from the sky. I hope not. And this could be my oh. pina colada. What a great idea here in hey. town, right here on the sidewalks of Corza. You can get yourself a smoothie or a frozen drink. I mean, this is great for tourism. I got my pina colada here on the sidewalks of Corza Town, here at the Smoothie Place, Smoothie City. Let me try it out. Wow, that's good. Very, very good. I love it. Perfect, cheers. Smoky Lane Barbecue, they make they sell barbecue here. Mike. Yeah, my mic is on, my audio on. Yes, it is. So here we are in Corozal Town. Where the ground? No, nothing, Arita. So here we go walking around Corozal Town. Crossing the busy streets. Let's see if everybody, we can make it safe and sound. It's getting close to lunchtime. And you can see 
Everybody is heading home for lunch. Look at the traffic jam here in Corzal town. Busy, busy, busy place. Everybody wants to go home and eat. I'm gonna instead of the sidewalk, I'm gonna walk through the cars. Big tractor. Hey. Oh, I like I like the blinking lights on top of that truck. Wow, look at that traffic. No way I'm gonna walk on this. I better stick to the sidewalk. That it is just too busy. Hey. Yes, sir. How things are it? Yes. Okay. Wow, it's busy out here. So this is Corzal Town, guys. Around midday. It is a few minutes after 12. And it is busy as it can be. So I hope you enjoyed this little walkabout. Corzo Town. Hey guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this little walk about Corzo Town. This is a beautiful town. Great place to come and retire. If you want to come for a quiet, peaceful holiday. Whoa. What is that? That is a strange looking car from India. Look, it has sliding windows. Cool. I like that. I've never seen one of those before. Very cool. Yeah, so if you guys like these videos, please subscribe if you haven't done so yet. And give me a like, share, comment. People from Coraza, give me a little shout up, man. Left me a little comment on the video. I happy for see you know ya. Yeah. If you got a little idea, make a film. Just tell me about it. What's, What's up, up, dude? I'm there. I know what you got over there. Yeah. And I don't want to touch it. You're a big... You, I am a Masonic, and you're done from the Rosa Cruz. You don't want the Rosa Cruz. Me, no, I don't know Rosa Cruz. I don't know Rosa Cruz. I just want chain what I got. Yeah. But how are you wearing he's, it? He's saying about my chain here. Never. That's a white. I mean a white because in a, in a white, uh, nobody goes to trade. In a black then it will be different. Yeah. But not in a white. Oh yeah. Never, 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 never. <laughs> so things go with you good? I just I just need two dollars for complete for me to buy one EM. One burger man. You need two dollars to buy a burger? Yeah. Right, let me let me no, let me I, I, I no got two dollars. Let me see if I got here. Hold my camera and talk to the camera. Of course. Go a little bit um, further from your face, um, otherwise um, they're looking. Um, here, over no, here. Hold it a little further from your face, otherwise they will like lonely watch your teeth. Otherwise they're just gonna be looking at your teeth. Um, now you can. Here, talk. over here. That this guy was doing for me. He's a guy who was coming. That he know who's um, and he know who's doing. And the privilege we got over here, give it to him because he's the man. No way. Remind them to subscribe to my channel. <laughs> Just remember that this what you see over here in this camera that we over here. And we're trying to see if we could go blow to make it show we, who we are. We, 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 we are here. <laughs> Alright, so what's your name? Tell them your name. My name is Arturo Guy. To Arturo Guy, alright. Two dollars? There you go, two dollars for you, man. Take care. Yeah. So you're gonna go get your burger now? Yeah. You get burger or you're gonna get Chipilin? I wanna get one and burger. My burger? Good boy. Burger. Good guy. Alright. Take care man, next time. Take care. You know Aisha. Oh I'm Frank. This boy's coming right here from this from Detroit over here. Madden Sea. Here. That they, that they con con where you come right here and you tumble maybe one nice guys and everything 
And if you are trying, we'll make it try to give the break to anybody here who will show who he is. In. In okay from where you come from and from no from. But he will, he will get you back. My watch with you. Exactly. Yeah. All right, then. I'll see you next time. Well, one dollar more for I, I, I give you the last one. I never got no more. Okay, okay. Then. All right. See ya. All right. <laughs> hey, Mark, how are you doing? How is Mark? You want to come say hi to YouTube? Yeah, on YouTube. Come out here, say hello. This is my friend Mark. He has a little supermarket and a little restaurant. You still got the restaurant? Fried chicken and that? No. Oh, no more restaurant. Oh, only, only supermarket. So this is Mark. Originally from what part of China? Huh? Originally, where you come from? Originally? China. China. Mainland China? No. Any, any city on mainland China? What city? City Canton. Canton. All right. So, guys, this is Mark from Canton, China. I lived in Corozal. Whoa, long time, right? How long? Over 35 years. Over 35 years. I know. Ever since I was a young guy, I I know Mark. He used. They used to have a little restaurant here. We used to come here and drink beer and eat fried chicken. And yeah, <laughs> good seeing you. You're gonna be on YouTube tomorrow. Tomorrow on YouTube on my channel. So you look for it, okay? All right, bye. That is Mark. He's owned this little supermarket and he had a little restaurant that sold fried chicken and stuff like that for many, many years. I think he didn't, his restaurant business didn't survive the two year lockdown. But he's still selling clothes and groceries and Cokes and beers and stuff like that. I wouldn't be surprised what all, you know, he got in there. It's, a little mix of everything. Originally from Canton, China, living here in Corazon Town for the last 35 years. Whoa, long time. I lived here for 45 years. So he's been here for a while. His son has a little restaurant on the other end of town. I don't think I've ever been there, but I know where he has it. This will be much better than the live because it will be clear. The live, the live was great. The live was really, really, really good. Except it's really a lot of digital static and stuff in parts of it. I'm sad that that happened. I wish it would have been good. We can't do it live every day. Hello. Hello, how you guys doing? Good. You guys got to be on YouTube tomorrow. Say hi to your friends. Hi. hi. What's your guys' name? My name is Anwar. Anwar? My name is Letty. And Letty. And your mommy? Hi. Kenny. Kenny. Tomorrow you guys see yourself on YouTube. Sometime tomorrow in the, in the day the video is going to come out. Okay. All right, thanks for talking to your camera. Bye. Bye. Corazon Town, everybody's friendly. Everybody's friendly. So a lot of people are very shy. But if they call me over, hey, I'll go talk to you. Hey, you're not from Corazon? Now you want to make a take you out for the video? Give me a little shout. Give me a little shout. And I go and go put the camera up on you. I'll make one little video so you can see it later up on YouTube. All right. Hi. What's up, dude? Hi, Douglas. What's going on, bro? Hi, Devin. How are you? Fine. I'm going to see you. Good. I talked to your wife. I talked to Douglas. He said, Douglas, come over there. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I make some leave YouTube videos. Oh, that's good. That's good. That's are good. you going to be on YouTube tomorrow? Oh, I see. Yeah, I, I record you right now. 
Yeah, yeah. Douglas. everything good. Yeah, everything good. Was in Canada. Hello, ma'am. How are you? Abril, you remember Abril? He doing good? Yeah, I know Abril. No, you don't know Abril. <laughs> <laughs> I know Abril name. Right now. <laughs> Too hot? No. You got pain? So, so you you did do the maintenance here in the park? Ah, so he's one of the park maintenance guys. Yeah, Yeah, works for the town board. The park is looking good. Yeah, yeah. I think Rigo, I think Rigo's doing an excellent job. The park looks nice and clean. Yeah, fountain is working. So how are you? I drink a pina colada. What? Pina colada. I don't hear you. Pina colada. Oh, yeah, you got rum. You drink rum? No, you know, that's a one thing I don't drink. He could tell you, man. That's my friend, you know. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, you don't drink no rum? Me, I don't Otherwise, drink. I would get you a pina colada, but since yeah. you don't drink rum. I don't drink. Oh. I drink next thing. Mmm. Uh, what do you drink? I drink that a tea, but I've got that make one. I, make I sit down, because it's hot food, true? Yeah, hot food. I okay, and... All right, see you, man. Bye. So, how old are you now, Abil? I know you from when I was little boy. What? I forget the food. Huh? I forget the food. No, my mind. No, can't plenty. Yeah. Because your memory to go. Sometimes, sometimes my mind go, and especially when I know that money right now yeah i want somebody give me one leaf a leaf 20 dollars you can't have to buy the thing yeah yeah money yeah. money is scarce yeah. money is scarce yeah and i got expense the need i got me leeway and school yeah and school one that a thing and i I uh, know I not work no, no, no. Yeah, I not work anywhere. I never did get your age. How old do you say you are? Huh? How old? How old do you think? 75? I got it correct. Really? 75? I got it on the dot. You don't look it through? No, you don't look it at all. Uh -huh. I know. I got I got more wrinkles than you. <laughs> and I'm much younger. <laughs> yeah. Oh, look, seaweed with peanuts. Cool. Yes, that's a seaweed. So you want to get seaweed? Look for her. She got seaweed with peanuts inside. How much one of them? Three dollars. Three dollars. All right. You want seaweed with peanuts? Okay. One seaweed with peanuts for April. Everybody know you. Everybody know you, yeah. One, two. One, two. <laughs> My last three dollars. Okay. All right. How your name? Lindsay. Lindsay. How long you been selling like this seaweed with peanuts? Oh, uh? Since coronavirus. Oh, from coronavirus time. Well, that's good. You know how to make the money. Yeah. Make a, You gotta keep making a living, right? Yes. Yeah. Okay. okay. This is my dad. Oh, this is your daughter. All right. Hi. Hi. Baby. Nice to meet you. Nice hey, you know Sitel? Sitel, eh? So how so how is the seaweed? Nice. Nice. All right. I glad you enjoyed. Katrina. 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 Katrina, the way for you get any day practical. Which class is that? We would do that. You don't come out then? I don't come out. Where where you where you work? Tomboard? No. Oh. Tacos, please. Mm. Oh, the taco restaurant. Yeah. I tell Abril that tomorrow you and she will come out by YouTube. So you have to get your phone and you show her because I don't think she knows how to use smartphone and YouTube, do mm -hmm. she use phone. I know she knows how to use smartphone. I, I don't think you use smartphone or that. My daughter see you. Uh, oh, you really? Your daughter watch it? All right, great. Your daughter watch her channel. Oh, what did you mean? That's good. Well, tomorrow you got to make your daughter show you because you guys are going to be on it tomorrow. Sometime tomorrow yeah, around know. midday, hopefully the video comes out because it's going to be a long one. I have to work tomorrow. Tomorrow, Saturday, Friday. Are you still going to Yes, I'm okay, my mom. Everybody got to work? Only have no work. Only have real. You're, re you're retired. It's time for you to retire. 
Right now, Cole. Well, nice seeing you. Right now, we'll come back. Don't forget to check out the video. No, yeah. no, she's going to go. I know, yeah, and I'm going, I'm going to go eat lunch right now, too. You better me. Yeah, so nice seeing you, Ariel. Well. Until next time. It's God's only. Yeah, I, I, I give me last coins for your juice. Otherwise, I'll give you only $5, but I don't have none on me right now. But I meet up, meet you up. You not meet me. I will see you somewhere, Ron. Huh? I'm not coming out. You're not coming out anywhere? You, but you don't come out all the time? No, all the time. Oh, yeah. No, see it Oh, yeah, your legs, your legs can't handle it. How is your wife? Doing good. She just went that way. She just went that way. You give out my regard. I will do that. Ah. Okay, then. Bye-bye. Okay. Where are you there again? Douglas. Douglas. You know how long I don't see Douglas? I know, long time. Was, we don't see each other like... Many, many years. Many, many years, yeah. Okay, bye. Bye, take care. All right. Abril here from Corza Town. She's sitting in the park, relaxing it, taking it easy. She said she had to sit down because her legs are starting to hurt from walking. <laughs> you afraid? You afraid for YouTube? You afraid? No, no, I don't like that. You don't like this? No, I don't like You know what I mean? All right. All right. People, um, I'm setting up my shop for Corozal Town Herb Shop. This is a um, process in 28 years I'm making. And I was like a student for Don Elito Panty for the past 30 years, 31 years or so. I've been um, working medicine for 28 years. And I've seen very good results from these herbs, these herbal materials and so. And it's a demand, people demand my services. so. I did a tour through the whole country of Belize, you know, and then I eventually end up caring for us all, and here's my hometown, and I get a satisfactory result from the production of these um, medicine, these natural herbal medicine, you know, and people mostly recommend me on the product, on the, on the product that I have. On this pier, we have some things for the um, general infection, we have for pulmonary, we have antiparasitic, and uh, for the prostate. Now up here we have some more things that we don't even have on the stock, you know? Yeah. Some things that we do for the uh, like idiotalic, prostate, uh -huh. colonitis, hemorrhoid, disinfection, lethal hernia, herniated disc, gastritis, diabetes, pressure in the problem, stomach problem, arthritis, irritation, jaundice skin, and many much more that is not written here. Yeah. Is what I could do. All kinds of herbal. of service for the public and I'm available. On, the, on, on phone calls, you know, I have my phone call at the 604 for the 605. All right. Yes, so you could get me on that number. So you could shout him up? Yes. Shout, shout him up. And your name again? Anthony Carter. Anthony yes. Carter, I know that. Anthony yeah, Carter. I know that. I'm available for the whole public, man. I, I could um, ship in any part of the world. Yeah. Yeah, any, anything you add up, I could ship it to the, any part of the world. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, so you may get trained with the Lihu Panty? Yes, I may get two years and three months. Wow. I went to attend to a problem, you know, I had my this, uh, this location on my wrist. Yeah. It gave me a lot of pain. Elihu you know? Panty is a famous um, herbal Herbalist medicine guy, yeah. Yes. He used to live in the jungles of Cayo. Yeah, San Antonio Cayo. Yeah. yeah. He's a renowned herbalist and he's also a member of the British Empire. Do, do yeah, do yeah, yeah, I know that. Um, if you Google Google Elihu Panty, you will see who he is. Yeah, Very yeah. famous in Belize. Yeah, and he to, trained this guy. I went to take care of a problem and then you know, I ended up learning because I had to give my service to what he had done for me. You know? Right. I never had enough money to pay him. Yeah. So I did my service to get him. Uh huh. To, uh, serve to pay back for, my, for what he did for me. Right. Then, I see good results with the herbs. Yeah. For myself and many people. I don't really sell, people recommend me, and that's yeah. what I do for a living over 28 years, you know? 28 years already? Wow, well, a long time. I've doing this job, yes. A long time. For me, for me, it's a pleasure to work it, because I like when people come like this, thumbs up. Yeah. yeah, I feel, yeah. When they, when they feel better again, sir. Yes, right? man, then they come and tell me, yeah, and they bring more people for me, too. Yeah. Um, it's 
it's not really meat, the herbs are pills. You know? Right, yeah. You just say it's the grape that, that makes the wine. Exactly. It's the herb that cures, you know. That cures you. Humble servant, humble servant for man and God, you know. Exactly. Like yeah. Like but then, um, of all and all, I am available. I'm available Monday to Fridays because Saturday I usually take my days off for my little churching. And yeah. Sunday for my personal doing, you know. Uh -huh. But I'm available from Monday to Friday. And it's a service, it's a humble service. I like to be of service to anybody. All right, all right. So, you know, you come and check him out. And he got all kinds of stuff. This whole shelf will be full when he's full finished. In a while, yes. when he's in a, a good <laughs> talking to you, man, and, and lots of luck, lots of luck. Thanks. You've been doing it for a long time, yes, so yes, obviously yes, something yes. is working. It's working, yes. Something is working. Yes, yes. It's, very, it's very effective. Yeah, 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 because you've been doing this business for a long, long, long time. So you know your stuff already. Yes, I know I'm, I'm fully packed. Yeah. <laughs> okay, see you, man. Have a good day. Bye. Bye. Okay. Interesting. Interesting people here in Corza. I didn't know he's been doing it that long. That's wow. He's been doing it for ages. Corza Town Belize. We had a great little walk around Corza Town. I hope you all enjoyed it. If you didn't yet, please subscribe. Share the video with your friends. If you're on, on, on the video, Share it with everybody in the world and leave us some comments, please. Left with some comments, we want to hear some comments. And before I go home, hey, how are you? Before I go home, let me grab a Coke. Hi, Hi. let me grab a Coke here uh, for the walk back to the house. <laughs> One Coca-Cola. You want to say hi to your friends? Hi. <laughs> say something in your language. Malamis? Chinese? Yeah. yeah. Ni hao. All right. <laughs> so I always come here and buy my Cokes, right? She says I drink too much Coke, right? <laughs> yeah. She always calls me I drink too much Coke. Then you, you have that video, then send me yeah. also by my family. Yeah. This, this, this come out tomorrow. Tomorrow, tomorrow this video come out. Yeah, tomorrow it come out. Send my family. All right. Mm -hmm. Okay. Thank you. you give me the you the care first. You the care. I don't got none. I'll bring you one. I'll bring you one. So, so bring you one. Family. Bring you my family. Yeah. Okay. Okay. I'll bring it. I'll bring it to you later. Okay. Yeah. All right. Bye. Okay. <laughs> Say hi. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> So, she says this is the store here, Home Best Supermarket. So she says they know us because I always buy my Cokes here. She says, write down the name of your channel. She says I could send it to all my family back in China. So I'm going to stop by later and give her a piece of paper with the name of the channel. And hopefully, yeah, or a card if I have any left. And that's it from Corza Town.